The motivation for painting the migration series is that I, I grew up in a period where we all knew about it. We, we were a part of it. My family was a part of that migration. My mother was born in uh, Fredericksburg, Virginia, and my father was born in South Carolina. Somehow they met, and on the way north, I was born in Atlantic City, uh, New Jersey. So I grew up knowing about these things from, from the first time I could understand what words meant. And, and uh, as we moved further north, I remember Atlantic City. We didn't stay there because we were on our way north. I remember eastern Pennsylvania. Then we moved on to Philadelphia. In 1930, we arrived in Harlem's, New York's Harlem community. I was 13 years of age. Uh, it, was, it was a very vital, very energetic, very alive community. I used to hear, especially in Philadelphia, my uh, parents would talk about another family arriving and people who had been there a year or so before would give them clothes, take clothes to them, take uh, coals to them, you know, for the furnace, and things of that sort. So I grew up very conscious of people moving from one uh, section of the country to the other. I pick up my life and take it with me, and I put it down in Chicago, Detroit, Buffalo, Harlem, any place that is north and east and not Dixie. I pick up my life and take it on the train to Los Angeles, Bakersfield, Seattle, Oakland, Salt Lake, any place that is north and west and not south. I am fed up with Jim Crow laws, people who are cruel and afraid who lynch and run, who are scared of me and me of them. So I pick up my life and take it away on a one-way ticket. Gone up north, gone out west, gone. Time to lose. Going 
time to daddy, got no time to lose. All the alone can kill my 